What is up, Radix? Welcome back to the Cal Perico Heist Update. In this video, we're we'll taking a look at the brand new weaponized thingy that released today, February 25th, 2021, at about 4.30 a.m. Eastern Time. So, officially, pretty much the last drip feed vehicle of the update, even though we still got the Brioso 300, they got to put back on the website, but technically, this is pretty much the last vehicle we were waiting for. $1.85 million, which is just... <laughs> Absolutely nuts. If we go back to the uh, Doc T's website, where we find the original dinghy, let's go there really quick. You'll see that the dinghy only costs the regular one hundred twenty-five thousand. So you're essentially paying over two point seven million for well one point seven million <laughs> for a gun on top, which is just absolutely nuts. Um, but yeah, I already went ahead and bought it. Obviously, I buy it for you guys so we can review it. So let me go ahead and go on Pegasus here. It is a Pegasus vehicle, as with pretty much every boat in the game. And of course, Pegasus vehicles have no customization. Go to boat. Up a nice dinghy. Spawn. Nope, oh, there we go. So there it is, and that is the only color you can get it in. Um, this weird color combination. Hop over here. Oh, made it. Yes. All right. Yes. Let's back up here. Oh, steer a little better. There we go. Let's see. I mean, most of you have probably already <laughs> driven this many times on the Galapagos Equal Island, um, whether you're trying to escape or what have you. Now you can actually buy it for yourself and use it in Los Santos, which is, I guess, okay. <laughs> um, as far as the gun in front, it's pretty much the same one from the uh, patrol boat. Let me hop over here. It's pretty much the same gun from the back of the patrol boat. Yeah. I mean, I guess it's okay, but I mean, overall, I don't really see too much of a use for this boat, if I'm being honest. Um, I, mean, I think it's, like, pretty overpriced, in my opinion. Um, I mean, it is pretty quick, though. Definitely not as fast as the long fin. We gotta remember that boat exists, and is a lot better, in my opinion, in many different ways. Um, but, but, I mean, this thing is still pretty cool. Let me make it to my yacht over here, so I guess we can park it next to a, a regular thingy. And kind of compare them, but I mean, the difference between them, there's no difference in performance that I know. Um, supposedly, it's exactly the same. Um, all you get is the, the gun right at the front, so pretty much a difference there. Over here. There it is. For those of you who don't know, you can hold L1 when you're driving at slow speeds to turn a little better. There we go. There's a difference there. Pretty much the same thing. <laughs> well, yep. I hope you guys enjoyed. Pretty short video. Um, really isn't much to talk about. There's no customization for this thing. Um, costs $1.85 million, which to me is just absolutely ridiculous. This thing should cost no more than 500000 in my opinion. Max, 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 no more than 500000 Especially since the regular uh, costs 125000 So, again, see no point in buying this at all. Not even a little bit. <laughs> um, not really much of a use for it in online or free mode. And you can't customize it. Maybe if you can customize it, that'd be the only excuse, um, reason you can give yourself to buy it. But other than that... Not really worth it in my opinion. <laughs> Anyways guys, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.